Hello everybody, this is Death Dome, the Windows 95 game that came out as a demo CD-ROM until 96, the corporation of the full version of the CD-ROM. So, let's get this started, and this is the training guide here, you can read, that has all the information that you need. Alright, and you can make sure you read the whole entire thing, you don't have to read the whole entire thing, but it's just telling you what the story of it is. The runner you're going to be running, which is the car. As well, the primary weapon, the laser cannon, and also the GS, the barrier. Then we also have the secondary weapons, which are really nice. The nitro ram, the sports missile, the shockwave, which is really nice to use in good situations, the structure, and the iron sword. Then we also got the nano shield, the health form that keeps you up to 100% if you're really down low. And as well, the extra life credits, which I'll show you where they are as well. So, I'll be showing you all these things, how to use them, and go from there. So, let's have fun, and here we go with Death Dome. Select your runner. And you see there's def different runners you can have in the game, and pick which one you want. I'm going to set my options up just a little bit, because I want to make sure you get the good graphics out of this. That's a little low on my sound. Alright, so now we got my runner. Now, there's no save points in this game. The only save points they give you is pretty much the codes. Select so you see all these different hand. maps we have to play and enter, code enter code. Now. So we're going to have to enter a code there in order to get to the next map. So what we're going to do in this situation is do one map, stop the recording, then do the next map, so on and so on. Unless we go on on a good chase here, like I, if I feel good, I'll keep doing two maps at a time. We'll see how far we get. Keep in mind, we'll be doing two first two rounds as the minimum, and then the third round we'll do the whole fire and fun thing. Unless there is keys I need to collect. In this situation, there is a key in room one, so we're gonna have to get that. But first, let's get the first two kills. That really sucks. Let's get the uh, little right there. Um, and if you want to do this very easily, you can just trap them like this. Wow, purple tried to be smart. You may now exit the domain. Now we're going to one. Right and we get this blue key. This is where you get the blue key here. And obviously, blue key door. And you get extra life. That's pretty much what it is about. And, uh, well, we're not gonna chase it, so we're getting out of here. We're not here to have fun just yet. That's gonna be in round three. For now, this is just a little bit of a walkthrough of what's in this map. Now that room three has round the green key, two. so we're gonna get that next. But for now, let's get three, three kills at the two, minimum. One, but first, go. let's do a little trick. Immediately, get that purple, and don't ignore it. Just get him out of here. All right, now we gotta get the red and blue. Aim for that shockwave. Do not miss that jump. To do this perfectly, you gotta do this. Oh, Sometimes you can get these both. That really sucks. Now you're gonna get killed. There we go. Now we got that done. Let's go to room three, which is the green key. Keep in mind, now he has a friend with him, so that's good. No, we keep it now, shield on the case. What you want to do first is cross this little ledge and get the green key. You can also jump here if you want, that's up to you. You don't really have to do what I have to do, but you can, I'm doing the safe way to get the green key because it's much faster. Alright. 
Here's the green key. Let's go in here. And look, a shockwave. How fun is that? There we go. And we're gonna get another shockwave. And how fun that spin of double kill. <laughs> Yeah, that's how big the shockwave is. That's why you really want to have shockwaves in here. Because it kills just like that. And that's just a taste of what I can do in this game. Anyway, we're going to have fun on the third round. And we're going to get the final key, which is the red one, in map four. Around here, in uh, do door four, whatever. <laughs> round three. So let's get door four as three, quickly as can possible. Two, one, so go. immediately go there. Go this way and activate the fusion tower. Just knock into it. A little boop. Right, see the yellow and purple coming around? Shoot right there and you get both of them. See that guy running out there? Shoot him. Because you got a mercy kill. Which, in other words, it's just a. You kill Okay, now we get the red here. So that's the red key, and now you got the whole entire keys. Don't run up too fast. You want to do it right here. Look here. And you get an extra life. That's it. You get the structure. Nope, I'm not gonna get that. But we're gonna go this way. Now they might be fighting already, so we're not gonna instruct that. The shockwaves take a minute to respawn back in the game, so you want to use them up and then go around and get more. The more you use, the better it gets for you. But sometimes you don't want to waste time with them. You just want to get them and get out of here. That was a gift. Mm. Get this one right here. Okay. I get this here. Hurry and 
get this going. When that scrub comes. Oh my lord. <laughs> oh, this was done around three. And uh, yeah, beware that scrub, just to let you know. Because that scrub can kill you. The second you get hit, it's game over. There's no second chance with that. And you have to start all over again. Unless you know the codes. right here and this is the next code for the next map so I thank you guys for watching and we're gonna go to the next one which is two revolt that's the code we have to remember and we'll go right from there thank you so much for watching I hope you guys have a great night this is dog dragon TC signing out